hello everyone welcome to the ASP.NET MVC tutorial so this is my first tutorial in this tutorial I will just make you understand how can you create your first MVC 5 application so these are the softwares that needs to be installed on your system so go and get Visual Studio 13 or 15 SQL Server Management Studio of any version any web browser like Chrome, Mozilla, etc. Now let's get started with MVC. So what is an MVC? MVC is an architectural pattern that is split your application into three component model, view and controller. So what is model? Model is your domain data. It just hold your data and it consists a lot of classes. Views. Views your user interface so it decide what how the end page going to look like controller so controller controls the whole application flows so it just take the data from model and render it to the view now if you see the flow when the user request goes to the controller it just update the model data and the updated data get back to the controller and controller render it to the view now if you create your first application then you will s notice that there are three folders controller model and views so we'll see in visual studio so let's flip to the visual studio and create your first project just click on file and create new project So now name it MVC tutorial. Now yes. If you see there are six options. Either you can create empty template or you can create MVC in order to develop an MVC application. So just click on OK and wait for some minute until Visual Studio just setting up your application. so here you go so visual studio has created template for you so it has created a controller folder model folder and views folder now close it and open your controller folder and go to the home controller now if you see the controller name home controller and it has index method and it is returning action results so what is action result we will see in a later video session so let's run this and let's see what gonna happen so now close all dummy session so this is your first application now create your own method now stop it and just close it and copy it and delete all this you can write your own method and you can return a string and name it hello world and you you know how to handle string now name it hello world now save it and now let's run it now copy this method okay now put a slash and name it home and again slash and this is your controller name home controller this is your controller name and this is your method name so if you press enter then your hello world is there now stop it I'm gonna pass a parameter string name 
okay and now I'm gonna return this name and now this run what's gonna happen now if uh, double click on this right this left bar and it will just place your debugging field now press home controller name and hello world is your method name and put a parameter name equal to Ashish now if you press enter then it will goes and you can judge Ashish has just passed and if you continue then Ashish will be printed so this is the basic overflow so in the later video session we will discuss about the controller model and view in a detail so uh, here you go so this was uh, MVC tutorial this was the first tutorial and if you like it then please give a thumbs up and comment and uh, subscribe my video and don't forget to watch my next tutorial thank you very much